Hey folks, it's Michael from NTX Barbecue Supply doing a short video about the Pits and Spits pellet cooker. About a year ago, I started doing research on what is the best made pellet cooker on the market. And looking at Yoder, Memphis, Blazin, Gorilla, all the top names, I came to Pits and Spits, which they're based out of Texas. They've been making custom uh, cookers and smokers for over 25 years. You can see the attention to detail. This is the heaviest gauge steel used in any pellet smoker, which is seven and 10 gauge. This is a retractable lid that they have used on their smokers for many years. It doesn't knock anything off the shelf. It kind of makes you feel like a man opening this thing. It's, it's just, top quality these trays come out this is the 1250 model which is 1250 square inches of cooking space here's your hopper this is where you hold your pellets 35 pound capacity which is the largest on the market this controller can be set between 180 and 600 degrees one of the cool things is you put your meat probe in your whatever you're cooking and you can set that temp so if I'm doing chicken at 165 this controller once it hits that number will drop down to 180 and keep the meat uh, warm so you can see you not none of the uh, shelves or anything are extra it comes with everything is fully welded there are any rivets or screws this barrel design, which they've learned for years, creates consistent temperatures throughout the grill. There's also, we don't have it on this one, but you can buy, this is the drip tray. You can buy the pull-out drip tray, which opens up right in this area, and that'll let you get up to over 650 degrees for searing a steak. This is one of three models that they make which is the middle size. This is the 1250. They make an 850, which we've already sold one last week. And then the 2000 is the same bottom part as the 1250. It's just got more vertical space and more racks. I've seen a guy put 30 uh, racks of ribs on that 2000, which is 2000 square inches. So I uh, wanted to just show you the overview. There's a paper towel holder. Um, it comes with the front shelf, like I said. So if you want to come by and check out this just awesome display of Texas uh, craft, craftsman work, uh, come see us in downtown Denison.